Night vision goggles are here in Sons of the Forest in update three. Here's how you get them and here's some really crucial info you need to know about using them properly. So first off, they're going to be in the cave where you found the chair with the skeleton sitting in it. This is the brand new cave also that they adjusted in the last update where you actually exit out of the cave that's above near the waterfall. You can see the river going all the way over to the left hand side. So this is the entrance way and this is where you should find the goggles. It's pretty much the southwestern most cave if you're looking at it from this angle which is the way that maps should always be looked at. You won't find any enemies inside and you will find a pool of water that you can travel up but you eventually lead to a slope that you won't be able to get up to as it's a one way exit and entrance for this cave from the other. Now just like the guitar in previous updates sometimes it might not show so if it doesn't make it save game outside the cave reload and hopefully it will appear but it should appear on top of the skeleton's head. As you might expect using it in the daytime is not a good idea it will pretty much make you blind and a few other things to note, obviously any light source that you're using, whether it's a flashlight on your gun or the flashlight in your hand, that is going to stop you from being able to see properly. This also means it's not ideal when you're diving as there is a light on your diving apparatus as well. Although you can still see it does intermittently flash and make things maybe a bit more difficult. And if you've been wearing tech suit armor, well, them lights aren't just there for show. They also interrupt with how you see things. As soon as you take it off and put a different armor on, you'll be able to see much clearer using the night vision goggles. Using flares will create a small extra foggy effect when walking through it while wearing the goggles. But it's not a blinding light, at least. You can see the cone or the area as you go through. Obviously any other light source is going to look really strong so you will have to alternate quickly between wearing them or not. I'm hoping there'll be a button that we can use just to turn them on or off or flip them above our heads maybe in the future. But absolutely they make some of the toughest caves a lot easier now. The last cave they added or revamped was the massive caverns where you find the deposits of the mysterious ore and where you now get the golden suit. It makes this cave much easier because it's such a large cavernous area it's always been a bit hard to do a guide to show places but now I can pinpoint every single enemy, every single box and show you the different routes to go by using the night vision. So look out for that guide that's going to be incoming a fresh one taking a look on how to get the golden armor suit. In a way, I kind of feel like they should have made the goggles also a reward that you could only get by completing this cave. And maybe that's why I didn't find them when I first went in. But from what I can see from Discord, no one else has mentioned this. And a few others have said that it's either appeared or hasn't appeared in their world. But it would make the most sense to get the best reward for completing one of the toughest caves after you've completed it. Instead of going to that cave first, picking up the night vision goggles and then reverse doing the rest of the map or the cave. Obviously uses batteries as well, so you have to be careful now and conserve a lot of your batteries and decide what use they're going to be. But it did seem to give me quite a long time here without it draining after a good amount of running through this cave. There may be other locations, but I don't think so. I think that's the only one so far. And that's it. Anything else comes up, I'll give you a rundown in the recap of Update 3. Go and check out how to use power and how to use the brand new electronic bicycle. I'll see you rat bags later.